racing stripes. This one is ice, so it makes me laugh. Oh, and this one was my dad's when he was a kid. All of these cars are super special, but I want to see which one is the fastest. So, I'm going to race them. Which one do you think will be the fastest? Let's find out. On the count of three, yell go with me. One, two, Three, go! And we have a winner! That was so cool! Who? Who? Hey, it's Ollie! Hello, Manny! Who? Who? Racing your cars, are you? Hi, Ollie! Yeah, I just found my fastest race car! That one is special, it's true! Our story's about one special thing, too. Listen to this. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through who? Ollie's got a Bible story for me and you. Aw, you guys are sharing your toy. You are such good friends. Oh, <laughs> Speaking of friends, hey everybody, I'm Carrie the dog walker and I am so glad to see you. I'm here with my best dog, Stormy Jane, and her friend, Goldie. Say hello, guys. <laughs> well, today we are talking about the number one most important thing we could ever do. This is big. Drum roll, please. The number one most important thing is to love like Jesus. Yes, loving others like Jesus is the best thing we can do. How do we love like Jesus? Well, I have some stories about Jesus that show us. One time, there was a man who couldn't walk and he needed help. And so Jesus helped him walk. Helping our friends is one way we can love like Jesus. If they're sad, we can help cheer them up. If they need help learning to play a game, we can help teach them. We show others we love them when we help them. Another time, Jesus was teaching a lot of people and they all got hungry, but all they had were two fish and five loaves of bread. Jesus prayed and thanked God for the food and shared the food with over 5,000 people. That's a lot of people. Sharing with our friends is another way we can love like Jesus. If we have an awesome snack, we can share it. If someone wants to play with our toys, we can give them a turn. We show others we love them when we share with them. There's one more thing I want to tell you about Jesus. One time, some people brought a woman to Jesus and were saying mean words about her. Jesus chose to love her and was kind to her. Saying kind words is another great way we can love like Jesus. We can say thank you when someone helps us. We can tell someone they look nice today or make them laugh. Saying kind words can really make someone feel loved. So that's it, friends. We can love like Jesus. We can help, we can share, and we can say kind words. And do you know when we can start? <gasps> right now, we got the green light. So start your engines and let's go, go, go and love like Jesus. Oh, hey there, Ollie. Ollie, tell me, who can love like Jesus? I can love like Jesus. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who can love like Jesus? I can love like Jesus. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. 
I'm going to go love others now. Bye! So there's your story. And it's all true. The one most important thing is to love like Jesus in all that we do. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Hoo, hoo. Wow, there's only one big thing to remember, and that's how to love like Jesus. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did say, got it, get it? Got it! Good! All of these cars are super special, but they would be even more special if I shared them with my friends. I'm gonna invite them over to race cars with me. I'll see you guys next time, bye!